Well, before the remake with Dakota Johnson and Chloe Grace Moretz and so the Swenson comes out, I decided because of reviews from Drum Dums and a Stardust reaction from Talk Movies with us and hearing praise about it, why not check it out? So, let's get into it. <laughs> Suspiria, directed, produced, written, and narrated by Dario Argento, and composed by Dario Argento, tells the story of a girl named Susie who travels to Germany to attend ballet school. When she arrives on a late stormy night, no one lets her in, and she sees Pat, who is another student, fleeing from the school, and written Pat reaches her apartment, she is murdered. And the next day, Susie is admitted to her new school, but she has a difficult time settling in. She hears noises and she feels ill and she sees people taking dying pretty much. So as more people keep dying, she decides to uncover the history of the place. And we have our very weird, but supernatural awesome horror film. Now, this has been referred to as The Three Mothers, which compares, which is one of the trilogy films. The trilogy of films by Dario Argento, with this movie... Inferno and the Mother of Tears, and this is one of Dario Argento's most successful feature films, re receiving a lot of praise. The visual style is great. I love the visual and stylistic, stylistic flair. It's very horrifying. It's very intense, and it is very, very, and very cool. I like the use of vibrant colors in here i because me i like to be see colors in movies that's basically my thing i like seeing colors and seeing colors is no different i love seeing the colors color c colors is e easily my my kind of thing while i don't mind desaturation I feel like sometimes desaturating your colors can take away um, you, how much you will enjoy a film. I will say this is, whew, this is without a doubt intense, without a doubt freaking intense. Oh my god, oh my god! It is violent, it's creepy, it's atmospheric. Which is something that most some of these horror movies that come out nowadays need to to learn. Atmosphere, and I think Dario Argento he wrote he wrote a darn good horror film. He directed this. The way this movie is shot, the way this movie is lit, the way this movie is framed. Oh my, wow. Dario Argento, this guy is awesome. Guys, awesome. The acting is great from everyone. Jessica Harper is basically an Italian cast, and there are two versions of this movie English and Italian. Which one did I watch? Well, that's that's 
that's a question for you to choose on your own. Stefania Cassini, Flavio Bushi, Miguel Bos, Ada Valley, Udo Kier, and there are, so he also narrates this movie, so that's also a plus. Music in this movie is great. I like the music in this movie. It is the main title theme is cool. All the choices here are really great. Now, there were a total of eight minutes had to be removed before this movie was released. And I have to say this, movie just plays no games. It is scary, it is, vo it is creepy, atmospheric, the acting is great, the performances are great. And I'm curious to see how, how Ludica Guadagnino is his version is going to be with Dakota Johnson, Chloe Grace Moretz, and his version is going to be set in 1977, which is in the year the original film was released. And this movie fo and it will focus on the force of motherhood. And but yeah, this is in this is a very intense movie if you have not seen Suspiria I'm not saying no spoilers watch it watch it Suspiria gets an epitastic with my JD rainbow seal of approval that's how freaking badass this this horror movie is oh my god oh my god now I was gonna show some Stardust reactions but didn't really work out but let me know what you guys think about Suspiria down below if you've seen it I know drum dumbs likes it do you like it do you hate it this is my first and probably only Dario Argento film I'm not sure but his daughter's pretty pretty good 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 too Asia Argento she's a good actress I haven't seen her in a lot of movies, but she is good from what I've seen her. It's a feature from Adrian Fario. You guys, keep it cool as always. I'll see you in the next one.